Hello everyone, Smashy3 here. Today we're going to be retrieving a 1983 Gavril H series van. The reason we're going to be retrieving this van is because my boss spotted it while river rafting in one of the many rivers in this map. And he really wanted it because he saw it was the highest, the, high, the very high end model with a four wheel drive and a Ex not an expensive engine, a high performance engine is what he found online as well. So he wanted me to ret retrieve it for like a hundred bucks. So that's pretty good. I'm gonna do it anyways. But um, yeah, so we're gonna, it's like in a, it's in a river with, with a, it's on a sandbank with a bunch of rocks, like where you would cross the river. So we're gonna go do that. And to do that, I need these big all-terrain tires with, with dualies as well but yeah those are pretty big as well so we're gonna definitely need those and i have a chevrolet front if you haven't noticed this is still a d-series it's not a mod not a full-size car mod it's just a facelift and i will do a review on that mod a little later maybe it'll probably be my next video maybe tomorrow or the day after but, um, yeah, well, I think we're good to go, but, so, yeah, let's do it. From the photos, it seemed this thing had been there for quite a while. It has a lot of rust, and it has some parts that are not in the greatest of conditions, but he, we can still work with it. If the engine turns on, this will be a massive profit. If it does not, it will not be a massive profit. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm using the wheel as well, my Logitech wheel that I used in the previous video. Um, it's pretty good, but yeah, we're just going to go straight there. I am using a GPS because I do not remember the full way there by Parts, I guess but this is much easier and it's not too far this map isn't that big it's not that far away so we should be there in about like five minutes and yeah um also there seems to be he must the person who owned that van must have either changed the wheels or taken off the hubcaps because that they're all black and it's just the basic steel wheels, nothing like, no, I, like nothing special, nothing chrome, just black steel wheels. So either it had hubcaps or it took the original wheels off and replaced them with those old ones. But yeah, I don't even know how many are all right and how many are punctured. He's, my boss said he couldn't see if any were punctured and they looked all fine. But that was just on the top because it was half, it was like half of the wheels were in the water, so yeah. And um, we're nearly there. I just hope my biggest concern is if my D series can make, even make it through like all that off roadiness because all I did was just add those tires. I didn't really make any engine upgrades. This is just the stock. D series and it's probably a lower end version because I am using the old D series, not the like the regular ones. I'm using that mod that allows it to be old and has more configurations. But yeah, uh, we're just gonna turn. Oh, what are these guys doing? Yeah, sometimes the AI cars are very um um <laughs> very. Well, I wouldn't say stupid, I would more say like, I don't know, like, drunk, <laughs> but uh, is this guy gonna move? Because I, I have somewhere to be. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna shoot it. Oh. That was worth it. <laughs> They're gonna just be stuck there forever. Um, we're nearly there, I think just maybe like a quarter of a kilometer. Yeah, like, we just need to turn in here. This is that trail that leads to the van. 
and it should be right here so I'm just gonna flip around so when we load the van he doesn't have to flip around himself so I'm just gonna do like a three-point turn or a two-point turn in this case because I'm not gonna be going forward I guess oh well I am so three point turn I'm just gonna line it up straight let's see is that good that's probably good enough Put all the stuff on, turn my engine off, turn the sirens on, press O, that releases the ramp because this is a wedge back and we are going to get in that van whether it means we're hot wiring it or not. <laughs> he did say that um, I could probably just go through the window but I think I don't want to do that so I'm just gonna Hot wire it, so just gonna get in. Oh, it's already on. That's concerning. <laughs> if it was on for this long, I don't know if the engine would still be fine, but I'm gonna just turn it off just so it can for once in like the 30 years it's been stuck here. All right, let's see if it cranks back. Oh, okay, this is bad. One more time. Again. Oh, there we go. Okay, so this is that engine that I was talking about. It probably sounds like this because there is no exhaust, but it's pretty good. Um, none of the tires have popped or punctured. And as you can see here, they're just basic old um, steel wheels but something that would concern me was if you look the drive shaft is basically falling off so I have to be really careful going places with this thing now let's see if it will if it's manual yeah that makes sense it's manual now we're gonna go up here full blast because I am not risking falling down this hill or not making it up but oh, there we go okay so I have to be really careful here because it is the dry shaft that will probably break in this process so I'm gonna go very very that wasn't slow but yeah you get the idea I was going to go up very very slowly oh I think I bent the ramp or something um yeah I don't know about that I'm just gonna head up this thing as low as I possibly can oh that doesn't sound good Alright, I'm gonna have to do it again. Hopefully the drive shaft doesn't like just come off. Oh, this is so scary because this thing is so delicate. Oh, okay. <laughs> At least it can survive that. Alright, let's see, let's see. Can I align it just right? Nope, I cannot. I'm not very good at this. Okay, alright. It is very hard to do. Alright, let's just see. I think that should line up. There we go, finally. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. I may have hit my glass, but I think that's what the $100 was for. <laughs> I probably would have. I don't know, $50 left from that. I am very scared it's gonna wobble off, so what I'm gonna do, just put the handbrake on. I don't wanna leave it in one, and I don't wanna leave it in neutral. Um, and I definitely don't wanna leave it in reverse, so I guess the best bet is leaving it in one. Yeah, I might have to spend the whole $100 on just repairing all of that. But, um, yeah, as you can see, the exhaust has come off, so, um, yeah, I'll just leave it there, I guess. 
Mm. Yeah, okay. I'm just gonna leave it there. Oh, I turned the engine off. Oh my god, I'm so bad. So dumb. Anyways. Get in our van. I mean, okay. Yeah, I'm just... Yeah, I'm, my brain's not working. I'm sorry. <laughs> Get in now. D-series. And I will go the slowest possible... No, I'm joking. I'll go carefully. Very, very carefully. Uh, okay, that is not careful. I wish this had this thing had lower suspension. <laughs> it looks so goofy in the mirror, it's just floating. All right, now to get back, I think I remember the way. So I can't do a turn very well with this thing. I'm just gonna go kind of. Oh, I forgot. Oh my god, I forgot to pull my ramp thingy out. Maybe that's why stuff wasn't going. Right, but yeah, okay, let's head back now. <sighs> this is so scary because any big turn is just gonna fly off, I bet you. Because it is not secure, all I have on is the handbrake. Well, at least we have the um, AI not running in my way because if they did, I would have been smashing them every turn. Uh, let's see, can I make it through the way we came? I'm going to have to go very carefully for this. Oh yeah, we can. I was thinking like the trees are like right there above us. But they are way, 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 way above us. Um, yeah, why am I looking for traffic? Oh, okay, so I can't really stop anywhere because that thing is just going to fly down. So I am going to pull over and fix it up. Yeah, as you can see, the rear, rear wheel is like just coming off. That is very scary. Right. Going to hold it and brake. Alright, that is... much better <laughs> all right turn the engine off okay 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 i don't care that my truck is falling off now i just gonna have to convince my boss that i need more than a hundred bucks because it was just so hard to hold this thing <sighs> okay <laughs> i love how just everyone stopped even though we're not like the police or anything just all lined up but i think we can make it back if i do some a reasonable speed not anything over i don't know like 50 maybe that'll be good especially around the turns let's see if i even remember the way back that was a problem that would be a problem i think i would do though and yeah not going past that 50 um, was this the way back? <laughs> I'm honestly forgetting. Now this is getting annoying where the AI is like stopping because the AI just when they hit look sees a siren it just stops. So um, yeah, I might have to go very just turn it off when they're in front of me, I guess. Or when doing yeah like that. <sighs> okay. I think I've got the hang of it now. Just all getting back home, that's the problem. Actually, I think I can just make it if I can shoot through. Yeah, I don't need them with the camera off. So, okay. When basically there, I remember the way now. You just, there's like a big turn, so I'm gonna have to slow down. Okay, this is annoying, so I have to turn the thingy back on. Oh, and the brakes now suck. Um, I don't know why they're stopping at this certain point, so I'm just gonna skip past them. Okay, that was such a bad idea. I'm just gonna wait for the sunburst to go. I just hope I don't scratch this guy, because then I have to do, I have to get 300 bucks probably, <laughs> instead of 100. 
make sure there's no cars coming. Let's go. Am I? Yeah, now they're on. Alright, we're nearly at the shop. Just gotta turn. Yep. You never know these days. Even with some AI cars, they still hit you if you have your light bar on. But we are here, finally. After that, I don't know, like, life or death situation, we made it back. And now I'm thinking, how am I going to get it in? Yeah, I think I've forced myself into this choice of going back here, like so. And putting it on... No, I'm not going to put it on the there just because it's old. I will drop it off right about here. I will go on the dirt. I will sacrifice my wheels, even though they've been in a lot of dirt today. I will still sacrifice them for the van. Now, I think we can unload it. I just need to wait for it to get out. Let's just go over here. Pop in here with the van. Let's see. Oh, I have to go the other way. Do -do -do -do. Okay. Now, let's see. Does it crank? There we go. Now, I will just be very... Oh, okay, okay, okay. That is not good at whatsoever. Yeah, my truck is basically destroyed now from the rear cab. I will try my best to get this thing along the ramp. It is very hard because... Okay, that's one way of doing it. Okay, I just broke the drive shaft. The thing that we saved just until now. Um, yeah, that's just fallen off. Yeah, the engine's just coming. Yeah, yeah, you can see that. That is not good. Um, okay, yeah. Okay, so that needs to come off. Alright, so we picked up this pile of poo, basically. At this point, I have no idea what to do with these parts. They just came off right now, so um, yeah, that's that's one way of ending it. Um, I hope my boss does something useful with this, something worthwhile. But yeah, that was basically the end of it. My task was just to bring it back here and see if I could, I don't know, <laughs> make it start, but now I just broke the drive shaft, so there's no chance of that. And my truck is broken, so I think I'm gonna get like 50 bucks from that. Um, guys, tell me in the comments, tell me one place I can actually get a good repair for this area of my truck with 50 bucks. If for whatever reason there is none, I'll just DIY, do it myself. And hopefully that will go well. Um, thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed, please like. Uh, you don't have to. It's always everything's free. You don't. You can choose to do it or not. Uh, if you want to see more stuff like this or other videos, uh, you can subscribe. That shows you like everything that I do. And uh, goodbye. Thanks for watching.